almost there. So, ready for your first day? First day? What do you mean? That's a shotgun. There she is. Or what? Oh. Building. Why? Go from the void? To a government black ops site? Uh, okay, bye. It, it, okay. What happened? What was the last thing I remember? Let's see. Okay. I do need to use the bathroom though. Much better. The last thing that was happening was on the train. Oh, it's fluffy. Well, nothing terrible could possibly come with this. I excite. Yes, hello. Real friendly. Goody. Okay, you're the transfer, huh? Yeah. You sure picked a day. Things a bit hectic downstairs this morning. Just uh, um, just grab your gate, pal, there. It'll help you get sorted. Oh, okay. Tablet. It's just a tablet. Security clearance. Okay. Thanks, okay. Most of what you need should be in your gate, pal. Well, eventually. Okay. But you're good to go. Head down to the elevator. It'll take you down to induction, and they'll take care of you. Okay, Jackson. I don't remember signing up for government. Oh. 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 Great. Radiation. Now I'm gonna grow five wings. Morning. Yeah. Lifts down there. But yeah. first, you need a hard hat. Uh, Health and safety and stuff. Grab that one and chuck it on. Okay. So, you've got what you need. Yep. Head through the gate to my left, down to the elevator. It'll take you down to induction. Okay, lady. I didn't even look at your name. I am still kind of baffled by this. How do I end up in situations like this? I don't... Welcome to the Gate Cascade Research Facility. Cool. You are in Hi, the induction wing. Cool. The facility is currently at alert level precautionary. Please listen carefully That's to and follow what all security instructions. That? Now arriving at Excuse staff me, what did processing. I just see? Uh was it was I I'm so Yeah, I guess I should probably wave at him. Hey, new transfer. Yeah. Uh, I got pulled in from surface duty. The usual lady, she got called out to help 
downstairs. Happens. Chaos is kind of our thing around here. You seem That's a bit antsy. Just wait. Good. I'll unlock the gate in a second. Now, I've never run someone through this, but it looks pretty straightforward. Coming from the Springer facility, you'll know the basics, but since we deal with specimens directly, everyone on staff has to know basic ECP. Uh, you, that's emergency are you sure containment I'm procedures. Are you sure okay, uh, now I have some instructions here that aren't really compatible with the current security situation around here, so we're just going to improvise a bit. Uh, Bear with me. Okay. I'm going to have you crawl through that vent down there. Consider it like chasing down an escaped specimen. Uh, you got a big brain, you got a big imagination, right? I mean, yeah, I played a lot of D&D &D and stuff, I guess. I don't think you have the right person, but you know, you're probably the one with the gun, so I don't want to get shot. Of course, why would doors be unlocked? Oh, flashlight. We take flashlights. Ooh. Well, scrap. Toolbox? Why would you leave this here? It's got so many useful tools. The if there's something in your way, because I put it there, uh, there oh, should be dick. a tool down there. Something you can smash the crate with. You might have to look around a bit. And don't worry about smashing stuff, like, we, uh, we, we have a lot of, we got a lot of crates. A lot of crates. Alright then. I'm not worried about smashing things. I've taken everything in your crates. My crates now. Bang. Oh, what the hell? This damn radio's acting up. There we go. Ugh. All morning. All right, where were we? They want you to capture a creature. Uh, the lady who's supposed to do this, she took all the nets downstairs with her. Uh, look around, maybe you can make one out of something. Make one? Oh, I mean, I take some of these clothes that I just stole from you. Yeah, I can probably make that. Oh, okay, I, I was just thinking I'd grab like a plastic bag for you. You know what, this, this is why we do the jobs we do here at Gate. Uh, go ahead. Nice, you've got some athleticism in there. Uh, somewhere? Uh. Now, real creatures might wriggle out of that one, but uh, that's not a real creature. So, next step is um, special containment, isolation, wash hands, inoculate. You, you know what? Just stomp on it. Stomp on it. Uh, it's got spikes in it. Look, there's rebar poking out of it. <sighs> Fine. Oh, oh, my boy. Brutal. Uh, okay, so next up... Uh, oh, what's going on with your leg there? Looks to me like you're bleeding. Um, look, Don't we'll call say. this training. Basic first aid. Find some cloth and make a bandage. And uh, just keep this between us for now. I'll, I'll buy you a beer in residence later. Sorry about that. Yeah, maybe don't tell people this... Okay, you did that way cleaner than I would have. You would, wouldn't you? You're gonna fit right in down there. Looks like you can walk on it all right. Uh, let's head you on through to the next yeah. room. Feel free to mosey. I've got to check some stuff out. We got we got some weird crap going on today. Not going to lie to you. Dr. Derek Mance reporting. Research Director, Gate Cascade Research Facility. After yesterday's fiasco, I've made a formal request to extend General Order Anomaly storage immediately. We requisitioned IS-113 only to discover that some effect from 221 had turned it permanently blue. I've made it clear to Anderson this is not acceptable. Ordo subjects may be deemed low risk, but the range of phenomena is too diverse to jam them together like sardines. So, I'm betting they didn't have these at Springer. It says here, all gate staff at Cascade need to understand the facility's unique power system. It goes into a lot of detail, only an egghead would want. Uh, no offense. 
Every power socket here comes with its own little extension cable and we build everything purpose built for those sockets. So what you're gonna do, you need to package the heater, place it back down near the power I socket, the, I read the and then the whiteboard. Okay, now I know that was a lot. I I'm getting some weird interference on my radio. I'm gonna leave you to the... Hey, nice work plugging in that plug. Uh, we're done here. There's some stuff on this list, but I, I don't reckon you're gonna need it. That's why you've got people like me around. Keep you safe. Looks Bruce, like I gotta check on some I don't situation topside. So, you yeah, hit the elevator, it'll take you down to residences. Rebar. Real cozy stuff. Uh, clipboard here says you're looking for a Dr. Can. Er, Con? Uh, it sounds familiar. Um, I guess he's in charge of the rest of your orientation. Alright, cool. onward to science. Well, onward to science, anyway. Bruce, buddy boy. I'm from the void, of course it's onward to science. The void is an unexplored area of time and space. Now we go to a top secret government facility of some kind. Yippee! Attention. <sighs> this is a high priority safety broadcast. Yeah. You are currently en route to residence level 7. Yeah. Due to an active security situation. What? Advanced safety precautions are in effect. Why? This elevator will be redirected to offices level 1. Please remain in place and wait for security team Out assistance. Out of the frying pan, into the oven. Of course. Oh, hey. No, no, no. No, no. No. Ugh. So good. Ah. What was the likelihood of us appearing in the same place? I... It, what are you doing? This is weird. Did, did you appear in a car? Yes. I don't know. Are you scaring me like this? No. No, no, no. Uh, well, do you remember what the last thing was? Where we last were? I saw a bright light when we were in the void. And I woke up in the car. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Yeah. Um. Well. I do feel we, taller, though. Well, you're definitely not a raccoon anymore. Still. You're not a dragon. 